Try to move on from a, a game like this. Too. You got to move on. You know, you got to flush it and uh, get ready for Thursday. And uh, but uh, definitely not the outcome that we wanted. Um, and uh, you know, as a competitor, you know, you, you you don't like to be on the other side of games like that. You know what I'm saying? So we got to be better and get better, quick, fast, in a hurry. Yeah, uh, Deron said that uh, you know they thought um, said we knew they were going to be fired up, and um, they they came out and they did after having lose to Denver. What 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 happened for you guys in trying to match that? And I mean, to me, man, it ain't about matching nobody else. You know, whatever they got going on, it's about what you putting in day in day out. You got to be whether you whether things going good for you, or going good for somebody else, going bad for you. Go, you got to be able to be able to and be a professional and go out there and be ready to play all at all times. You know what I'm saying? Any team could get beat any week in the league, so. I mean, you know, you, you just can't take games for granted. It ain't, been a, it, ain't, it ain't never been about the other man for me. So I, I don't know. I don't care what they had going on. But they came out and whooped us today. And um, that ain't no excuse that they love. That ain't got nothing to do with us. We got whooped today. Do you feel like y'all were ready to play today? Um, I think the, you know, I think the um, score was kind of indicative of, you know, I, that, that, Question. Obviously, um, things weren't going our right, going our way. Um, so, yeah, I think that scores indicative of that question. Why do you feel that that ended up being the case? I gotta go back and review the film a little bit, you know, and um, just process this one. You know, just coming off the field right now, I don't got the best answer for you. What about when this did you? Dallas offense kind of makes it as productive as what it what it was today? Um, you know, they definitely got threats on every level. Um, starting with the quarterback, you know, one of the best in the league. Um, receivers, great receivers, great running back, and um, solid, high competitive offensive line. It'll take you being ready to play. You know what I'm saying? And uh, you know they built this team to to go um, compete at a high level, and we got to be able to, you know, be able to play with whoever they put out there. But um, you know, kudos to them. And um, you know, you know, you can't. There's no excuse. Does a game like today show you maybe how much of a gap there is between this team and, and some of the top teams in this in this conference? Uh, no. Why do you say no? Because I said no. Did you see any warning signs coming into this game? You, you said you, the score in the case, maybe you weren't ready. Uh, I wouldn't say warning signs, but, um, you know, it was one of the things where that once that snowball got rolling, you know what I'm saying, mistake here, mistake there, it just keep piling up, piling up. Um, you know, I, I don't, I really don't have, the answer for you, if I feel like maybe you're asking about a prep, I feel like these guys work hard, man. We work hard day in and day out. You know, everybody work hard though in the league. You know what I'm saying? It's about going out there on the game day, putting a good performance out there, and being ready to play every time you step on the field. You know, and um, and that's that's what it's about. So um, there's no excuse. You know, whether it's in the preparation or whatever it may be, what they was dealing with, what we were dealing with, the Cowboys came out here and whooped the Falcons today. You know, we got to get better because we play the Patriots on Thursday. And we got to flush this one and we got to get better. Grady, it's always a challenge to play on a Thursday, but is, is this a really good time for a short week or an extra difficult time coming off this? I mean, it could, shoot, for me, I feel like it's a good good time. We get, get be able to get back on the field fast, you know, and um, try to get back to 500, you know what I'm saying, and uh, position ourselves for some postseason play. But we got to focus on it right now and uh, flush this one. Can't let this one beat us twice. And, um, and really, really got to let um, – you know, let our best football come out. You know, it's time for it. And uh, but for a team like ours, they're gonna take all. It take all phases, man. Take all phases. Did you feel like there was a hangover at all from last week and the way you guys won and, and the emotional kind of heft of that in some ways? No, kind of like the same thing I've been saying the whole press conference. Each moment is a new moment. You got to be a red play on the day of the, your game. You know what I'm saying? You know, yesterday wins don't win. To, you know, don't win for the next day. You know what I'm saying? Just because a team lost, that don't, that, you got to be ready to play in every moment, in the present moment, and uh, be able to perform. From your vantage point, when do you feel like it started to unravel today? Probably around the same time you did. I, I got to see the tape. Like, I, I don't remember. I'm just kind of fo focusing on the game. Thank you.